Look at this big simplification problem asked in one of the previous competitive exams. Can you simplify this mentally? Yes, without use of pen and paper. I'll show you how. Now, whatever I'm writing here is the thought process. I'm just writing to illustrate the working that should go on in the mind. So here we can see the terms, this term and this term, they are the same in the other bracket also, but the sign here is positive and the sign here is negative. So let's assume that this is A and this is B. Likewise, this is A and this is B. So what is the question statement? It is A plus B whole square minus A minus B whole square. Now, if you know A plus B whole square is actually A square plus 2AB plus B square. And when we subtract A minus B whole square, which is A square minus 2AB plus B square, the signs are going to change. So negative, positive and negative. And this term and this term gets cancelled, giving you 2AB plus 2AB as 4AB. Now, we just have to do 4AB. Now, A is 4, 11 by 15. So what is the improper fraction of this? This is 60 plus 11, 71 by 15. Now here we have 71 by 15 and B is 15 by 71, which is the reciprocal. So if you do A times B, it will be 1 because A and B are reciprocals of each other. And therefore, 4AB reduces to 4 into 1, which is 4. The answer for the question is 4. And all these steps which I have written here are mental maths steps.